Hi, I'm Dan. I'm a Chief Growth Officer, and I switched from Social Pilot to Sprout Social. For more reviews like this, click below. So having a product like Sprout Social or Social Pilot, uh, you have the ability to basically save time because it's going to schedule social posts for you, for instance, throughout the month. Um, if you, you know, create, uh, you know, a content calendar, you can create all of those things within an hour or two in the beginning of the month. And then for the rest of the month, you can focus on important, timely tasks. This is important as well. And that's why you want to get a social media scheduler like one of these. Spot Social is a great platform um, for all types of businesses. Uh, they have different tiers for uh you know, your, your entrepreneurial level, and they do a great job of uh, catering to the large tier, the large enterprise level. And so they do a good job of uh, helping everyone and making sure that uh, all of the social media needs that you have are met, you know, including uh, having, a, a, um, having a filter or having a, an area where, you know, you can see what's happening through all of your social platforms. So it's, it's basically a, a dashboard feed where you can see what's happening kind of in real time and know all of your different platforms, what's going on so that you can make educated decisions in a timely manner. Social Pilot is a really good tool for the entrepreneur, for the solopreneur. It, they do a great job of onboarding. And so when you go through the whole platform and you, you look at all the different things that you have to integrate, Social Pilot does a, a great job of utilizing those integrations like Dropbox or Google Drive and, and putting them into your social platform. So let me give you an example. If you have uh, pictures associated with your social posts, typically those pictures, those photos, those images are, are large file sizes. So what, what you could do is if you have a graphic artist or if you do it yourself, you put those pictures in the cloud Social Pilot does a great job of integrating with Dropbox, Google Drive, like I said, in the cloud so that you can grab those photos and that you're not wasting any precious space on your computer or on the local drive. It does a fantastic job of utilizing so many different integrations. Those are just two at the top of my mind. All right, it is absolutely easy to get started with both of these platforms. Uh, it's honestly, could take less than 15 minutes, probably closer to five minutes, because once you get your account and you just set up the, the preliminary information, it's literally going right into the, the platform, going into the dashboard. And uh, with both of these products, it'll show you a tour of what to do and, and how to move forward. So the onboarding process is simple, so simple. So some of the things that you'll want to consider when you're looking at a social media scheduler is uh, how much time it's going to save you by the scheduling part of it. And if that scheduler has what's called a, a queue, those are definitely some things that you wanna consider. And if the social media scheduler has a bulk upload, then uh, you won't even believe how much time it's gonna save you. Because between those three, bulk uploading is, is essentially, you put all of your content on a, on a spreadsheet um, and you work on all the creative aspects of your social media for like an hour or two at the beginning of the month so that you have everything laid out for the rest of the month. You focus all of your energy over there and then within that spreadsheet, you literally upload it. It's called bulk uploading. You upload it right into the platform and then um, the platform just schedules it wherever you want it, date, time, so that you don't have to think about it. Like you think about it right there in the beginning and then now you can focus on the tasks that you need to make sure that you, you know, get profits, you get your money, you talk to uh, uh, clients and collaborate, whatever it is, whatever you have to think of, you don't have to think about being creative for the month. So that's one thing. Making sure that it has a queue. So this is something that you usually set up in the beginning. Uh, when, you, when you do your onboarding with these different platforms, you set up a queue. So you, let's say you want something to go out every Monday at 8 a.m. So instead of going in there and um, each day putting in Monday, 8 a.m., this post, Monday, 8 a.m., that post, you set up a queue that says all of my, let's say, quotes. Let's say you do, you know, Monday motivational quotes. 
all of my quotes are going to go out at Monday at 8 a.m. So that every time you do something, you just click on that button, that cue, and that saves you that, that time of figuring out when this is going to go out and on what day. And it may seem, may seem kind of redundant, it may seem kind of insignificant, um, but honestly, if that's just one thing that you have to do every time, uh, it, in the long run, it'll save you. It'll, it'll save you sanity too, which is really of utmost importance when, when you're looking at something like this, uh, because the monotony of the re repetition can just keep going on and on. So when you have that kind of savior of, of what's called a cue, it allows you some sanity, which is something we all want, right?